Hi, my name is Michael, or you can call me Ambulant Science, and today I'm going to react to the new Rogue One, a Star Wars story teaser trailer. And this is so freaking awesome, and uh, Disney finally realized when to release trailers. They release, an, uh, uh, they release them in morning in the US, which for me is about this time, which it's 3 in the afternoon, so that's really awesome, because usually I have to wake up in the middle of the night to do live reaction before I go to school, so this is really awesome that they do it before, or um, in the morning in the US, so that's really awesome. They did the same thing with Civil War, uh, Captain America Civil War, but there isn't really much else to say than actually play the trailer, so we'll have it up in the corner here for you to watch and I will record my reaction to it then. So, one, two, and three. and undisciplined. This is a rebellion, isn't it? I rebel. We have a mission for you. A major weapons test is imminent. We need to know what it is and how to destroy it. Is that clear? Yes, sir. What will you do when they catch you? What will you do if they break you? If you continue to fight... This past year has been an amazing one for Star Wars. Um, yeah, I have freaking goosebumps, so that should tell you something at least. But um, this looks amazing. Uh, for those who don't know the story of this movie, this is basically how the Rebels got the um, uh, Death Star plans. And... I think that story just alone is really awesome and just the fact that they are really exploring the Star Wars universe now, which I love the fact that they are doing that. So we could get a movie from any like type uh, timeline. There's even been uh, some interviews with uh, Ian McGregor who played Obi-Wan Kenobi in the trilo uh, um, prequel trilogy. Talking about doing um, a Obi Wan movie, and it can take place basically anywhere. Yeah, he was interested in like in between three and four, which would be awesome. But nonetheless, Rogue One: A Star Wars Story looks amazing. I just love the fact that they're taking this seriously because one of the things that people thought when Disney bought Star Wars was that they wouldn't take it seriously. And that got proven with um, Rebels, in my opinion. Some people don't like that show, but I really love it. Especially now when we have Ahsoka and Darth Vader. Um, but I think Disney is doing a great job with handling this Star Wars franchise. And they are really building it for a future audience. And the most awesome thing is... We are getting a Star Wars movie every year for the foreseeable future. That is just amazing. I can't say anything else about that fact because I grew up with Star Wars. I've loved Star Wars ever since I saw it when I was six. Uh, and 
yeah, there isn't much to say. Um, I could go and really analyze a bit per uh, bit per bit, but one thing I noticed. Uh, I don't remember the character's name, um, but like the only the one and only other female character in the original uh, trilogy, uh, Mon Mothma, I think something like that. But we can see what I think is her. Uh, she has pretty much the same clothing and stuff like that, but it. Um, it's not the same actor, of course, because the original movie uh, is older, but um, uh, nice to see the uh, original Stormtrooper also. Uh, but one thing I have to say, I do not think this is a popular opinion, but I do actually like the um, Force Awakens uh, Stormtrooper's helmets. A lot more than the original ones but yeah the original ones are more iconic but I just love the look of the original or the Force Awakens Stormtrooper helmets but everything looks so awesome in my opinion with this movie um, so yeah the whole story is you know, that they are going to get the Death Star plans which I think is a really cool story and I'm really interested in seeing how that takes place. Um, so yeah, I can't really say anything else but that. But please rate, comment and subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you guys in another video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to click the subscribe button and also follow me on my social media. I have a link to all of those down below in the description. So see you next time guys.